Welcome everyone, it's Neil here from 3D Tudor, back today with an amazing geometry node and it's one you've all been asking for and you asked and we delivered. And no, this wasn't created in mid-journey or with some AI robot, it's actually in Blender and you can have this straight off the bat with these geometry nodes. So let's head on over to our blend file with the actual geometry node in there. So here is our empty scene just to show you what this is going to work like and the best thing is that we have this scene set up so the download file that you actually get will have all of the lighting set up. So all I need to do is just press shift A, bring in a cube and then what I'm going to do is go over to the right hand side, add in a geometry node and let's click the stylized stone. And there you go, straight off the bat you've actually got stylized stones. Now the best thing about this is that this also comes with our material that we've painstakingly made to actually use upon these stones, which gives you all of this beautiful edge wear and all of these color variations within the rock that you see here. Now, what else can we do with this rock? Well, the first thing we can do is we can make many of these rocks simply because you can actually come and change the seed. So we can change the seed to many, many different rocks, as you can see. So let's go with this rock here, just so I can show you what this actual node can do. First of all, we have the option to change the dimension. So we can change the width, we can change the length, and we can change the height as easy as that. Just basically moving these sliders around. We're also able to change how many points that we in here. So we can actually turn this down like so and change where the point distribution is on here, giving you a lot more variations within your rocks. But the best thing that we're able to do is change the roundness of these rocks. So you can see here we've got a roundness slider. If we bring this down, we can make it much, much harder edges like so, or we can turn it up and get the exact roundness that we're actually looking for to create those really, really stylized look. The other great thing that we've got is we can also change the noise. So if I bring up this noise, you can see that I can actually start to make this rock fairly lumpy. I can also change the noise scale and actually get exactly the look that I'm looking for for your stylized rocks straight off the bat. Is you're also able to change the subdivisions down. So let's say you're working on something where you can't have a site topology, well you're able to fix that as well. So you can see here I've got my first rock and all I want to do then is just move that rock to the side, bring in another cube and then I'm just going to hit that geometry node, click the down arrow, click stylize rocks. Let's put it on something like 15, like so. Let's go one more, make it a little bit bigger, like so. And then what we'll do is we can also scale it up like so or we can scale up just the height like so and you can see that material actually conforms then to whatever we want to do with this. To actually change this then into mesh, all you can do is go to object, convert, and change it to mesh like so. And then what you can do from there is you can actually keep this material on. So if I just put this on my shader like so, you can see how this material is actually worked out. You can see all the edge wear in there as well when you actually come into here. Or you can actually come in and actually unwrap this, take it into Substance Painter, and then paint it through there. Now for those of you interested in the geometry node, if we come over and click on this actual rock over here, here is the actual setup which we've actually created and you can see it's quite a complex node system but it does enable everything to be done easily and smoothly straight out of the gate. Now guys, I hope you really, really enjoy this actual node. It is one that hundreds of people have asked for and now a quick word from our sponsor and I'm sure you're going to enjoy this one. Hey everyone, do you want to have access to hundreds of Blender products every single month? Then check out our brand new Patreon, which is probably the best in the industry, especially for beginners to Blender. First of all, we now have four Patreon levels, pretty much for any budget. Or if you just want to follow us over there for the latest news on 3D Tudor, then that's also fine. So let's now take a look at these ranks and stay till the end to find out what we really have to offer. So rank one is all about just supporting us at five euros per month. And this is just to say a big thanks for everything that we do here. Rank two at 10 euros per month comes with a free course every single month. And if you've seen the scenes that we've been creating here on YouTube, where well, you can get your hands on any of these for absolutely free. And you will get your name featured at the end credits of all of our YouTube videos. Moving on and stepping it up to rank 3, at €19.50 per month, you get pretty much the same as you did in rank 2, but this time we also give you two geometry nodes 
per month absolutely free. And moving on to the big one, which is rank four, the top tier that we have at 48 euros 50 per month, and you pretty much get the whole shebang. Two free courses per month, any of our geometry nodes, any of our model packs, any of our YouTube themes, but best of all, you also get the complete asset manager file, complete with our entire library of compositors, materials, and assets and this will just keep growing so whatever your budget there's never been a better time to support us here at 3d tudor and i think we provide one of the best patrons in the industry so head on over check out our patreon follow us over there for the latest news and if you can we'd be very grateful for any support large or small all right everyone so i hope you enjoyed that one don't forget our brand new victorian scene is nearly ready to go so it's either going to be this weekend or beginning of next week you can get your hands in it for those of you who have pre-ordered you will get the invitation to download it and for those of you who haven't yet pre-ordered this is the last chance saloon so make sure that you pick it up it will be more expensive than our other courses it is 40 hours long but you can get it right now for $9.99 and I'll put the links down below. All right, everyone, so I hope you enjoyed that one and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks a lot, bye-bye.